give further debate. I recognize the member from London South. Thank you, Speaker. Assalamu alaikum. And I want to thank. Uh, I want to start by thanking the member from Ottawa Vanier for bringing forward this motion. Ottawa South is a community where families from 125 different countries, speaking 90 languages, have chosen to make home. We live together. We work together. We go to school together. We raise our children together. We are neighbors. There are not many places in the world where I, what I just described happens, and it's in many communities across Ontario. We live in a very special place, and it takes work to preserve that, and that is why we are here today. We have some work to do. A phobia is an irrational fear, and make no mistake, Islamophobia is real. I've witnessed it in my community through vandalism, harassment, and in words from people whom I would least expect it from. And we've seen the tragic results of Islamophobia in its extreme and what it can yield most recently in Quebec City. It is heart sickening. I'm privileged to represent many Muslim families. They are our friends and our neighbors, and we stand with you. Speaker, there is a political discourse south of the border that is poison, a cancer. And as the member from Nippie and Carlton said, we're not immune. Here in Canada, we have politicians, politicians using that same fear and mistrust for their own personal gain. We have organizations using Islamophobia as a marketing tool, clickbait for profit and then discounting it by using free speech as a specious shield. I want all Muslim families in Ottawa South, and indeed all Muslim families of Ontario, to know that all of us in this legislature stand with you. And that in this legislature and in our communities, all of us will always speak out against any form of hatred and discrimination when we find it. Thank you, Speaker.